Okay, the CH-80 is outside my state. It's a beautiful day out here. Um, had a great lunch, excellent food, excellent party. Thank you very much. Now, what I'm going to show you now is I've pulled the clutch off. This is the clutch right here. All right. And inside that is a spring. And I use my special handy little wrench to take it off. Put it back on. These are all custom tools. Here, here, and right down here. I've done it a hundred times. I'm going to uh, take the clutch apart, rebuild it, show you the part that needs to be replaced, which I looked uh, in all my parts trying to find um, um, another spring we could put in it. And that's one thing I can't find. I don't know why. Then I looked through my belt collection. These are um, my belts for my Honda 50. And I, I keep everything that I use because I don't know if they're going to be made next year. This is your belt right here. And it's in beautiful shape. This is a Bando. Um, it's a GE 7100. Okay, mine are 7500s, and they're about two inches shorter than this, so they wouldn't work. But I'm going to uh, um, clean up the clutch. I'm going to tear it apart, and I'll show it to you. The clutch is right here. The center clutch spring is right inside. I don't know if you can see it. Anyway, you'll see it when I take it off. You got a little bit of grease on the back here. I'm going to clean all that off. This is your bell housing which the, the clutch pads run on right here. I'm going to clean that up, run a little sandpaper on it. And look, I know, um, I know you're worried about the money, but don't be. I'm doing a bunch of stuff that we never agreed to, but think about it, we never agreed to anything. So technically, you don't owe me anything. And I'm, I just want to treat this bike just like my own, and I'll be very fair. So... I'm not doing this by the hour or, or any of that. I'm just I'm just doing a proper tune-up on it, like it like it was one of my babies over here. And if, I really love working on them. I just want to thank you so much that somehow God put us together, and um, you had a bike, and I've got the skill. So the next step is going to be. Um, Turn the clutch down. Also, this is synthetic motor oil, which I'm going to replace in your um, transmission. Your transmission is this little tiny part right here with the screw hole in it. It holds like, I don't know, a half an ounce. What you do is you empty the old oil out right here. It's got two or three big wheel gears in there. And the oil keeps everything lubricated. You empty that out, and then I use a, uh, a little implement here to put in new oil until it starts to run out. And then I put the, um, the screw back on it, or bolt, whatever it is. So I'm just trying to do, do the job right. And I don't know about the next seven days, because um, I've got to work every day. And uh, I'm getting off, but a lot of times in the afternoon, I'm really tired. But I just really enjoy working on this little bike. So don't be worried about costs, anything like that. If you're not happy with the work or whatever, you don't owe me a dime. After all, I don't need the money. And I'm not doing it for that. So let me, let me show you what I can do. And uh, I'll, I'll give you... For some reason, you had a moped to work on, you ran into the most knowledgeable person in the state by accident or, you know, design. But I want to show you what I can do with it. Anyway, it's a beautiful little bike. I would suggest it's got a street value to me of about $3,500. Okay, which you'll never get. But I would not part with this for twenty grand. It's just too good a shape. All right, I'm going to turn the clutch down. We'll take a look at that. 
I hope you got the three other videos.